What's up, everybody? It's your boy Hugh here from Create Up. Right now, I'm in an event center in Miami, Florida, and I am doing a live stream with for my client Mastercard. Uh, it's their breakthrough event. It's a internal training conference for the entire international um, department for Mastercard. So uh, behind me, you see this. Camera right there, but if you look behind me, behind you, sorry, behind you, you see the Insta360 Pro is doing a 4K live stream. Uh, if you see right there, you see the screen right here. It's doing a live stream right now. If you look down, look at that uh, fancy setup behind, uh, below the camera. Uh, we have uh, a VLOG battery right there, uh, power a 14 volt power into Insta360 Pro. We have the hard wide connected internet. Cable, so we can have a 4K high quality live streaming. There are a lot of like cable. Uh, there is a mixer there, but actually we are not using the mixer to do any audio. We actually connect directly into the. Okay, now we change the angle, but again, continue look behind me. Uh, you see the bottom part of my Insta 360 Pro doing a live stream right now. I actually connected with a H4n, a really old Zoom. Actually, work great, better than uh, the audio mixer. I using the Zoom. USB connect directly into the camera so we'll have a super crystal clear audio and the audio input level is 0 0.3 uh, it's really 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 low input level uh, so there's no noise and I get a line input from the DJ stand over all the way over on the left uh, from the mixing table they give me a clean line in for my audio and XLR it's still XLR cable right there and connect it to my uh, zoom if I show you right here you see that uh, Hopefully you see in the camera. But look at that, that is right here. There's a two XLR in. So it only give me a mono XLR and I'm using a splitter. So see, it give me a mono and then I'm using a splitter to turn it into a one and two. Now I have a stereo audio into the, the USB. Then this is the audio interface. Now the Zoom search audio interface and serve USB cable audio directly into the Intel 360 Pro. So we got really clear audio again. Um, I also have a Wi-Fi, little Wi-Fi thingy here, and the line in Wi-Fi is actually connected to the Wi-Fi hub, and then I will create a Wi-Fi, exclusive Wi-Fi network between my computer right here, uh, and the Insta360 Pro, uh, so I have an exclusive connection between here. And my laptop now can go wireless, this is really, really important, you don't want you to be in the frame to control the computer. Okay, we'll be right back. Okay, so the music stopped, we continue talking, right? Uh, look over again behind you right there live streaming my laptop is not connect into any ethernet cable which is great so i can sit way back there next to the sound booth and remote control the whole laptop we in my exclusive network provided by this little honor uh huawei little modem thing again any modem uh, work fine as long as you have wi-fi only between you and your laptop so you can control your laptop i mean your your camera remotely which is really important for live stream client don't want to see your face so let's look at what we have a second backup camera right here. You look behind me, you see this camera right here, the E VR360 is also doing a live streaming. Uh, one on the venue Wi-Fi is a backup camera, super close up, uh, low angle to the speaker. So we can provide two angle for the client to switch on YouTube. Um, well, again, uh, that is not like camera switching, live switching, but it's just two angle provide a viewer. A close-up view of the speaking section, the speaker, and an immersive view right back there with the Insta360 Pro. Uh, we shot in 4K, and this is only 2.5K. Um, so the client will be happy. Know that you have a backup camera if the Insta360 Pro go down. This one will directly, because it's all also live streaming, right? That one can directly replace your broken live stream link. So that is a really good thing to always have a backup in live stream. So hopefully that share you a little bit inside uh, what I do for professional client on live stream gig with the Insta360 Pro. Um, if you like this video, just give me a thumb up and, and don't forget to subscribe.